A shoe is just a shoe. That is until you have a collaboration between one of the best athletes to ever live and one of the most legendary sneaker designs. Then a shoe is not just a shoe. It is a cultural phenomenon that goes by the name of Air Jordan. Welcome to another episode of This Is Marketing. The year is 1984 and Michael Jordan has just signed with Nike to create his own signature sneaker called the Air Jordan 1. But there was one huge problem. The bold red and black color design was against the NBA's uniform rule that requires shoes worn on the court to be either 51% black or 51% white. So every time Jordan stepped onto a court in his signature shoes, he was hit with a $5,000 fine. And Nike was more than happy to foot the ball. For Nike, the ban was far from a disaster but instead a catalyst to turn the controversy into one of the greatest marketing campaigns in all of sneaker history, with Nike creating an ad that showed them leaning into the rebellious nature of the Air Jordan 1s. On September 15th, Nike created a revolutionary new basketball shoe. On October 18th, the NBA threw them out of the game. Fortunately, the NBA can't stop you from wearing them. Air Jordans from Nike. Nike expected to sell $3 million worth of Air Jordans within the first four years. But the shoes were such an instant success. In the first year alone, they sold $126 million worth of Air Jordans. At the time, basketball sneakers were made just for playing basketball. But thanks to the iconic Jumpman logo, Air Jordans held an appeal beyond the basketball court and became a part of mainstream fashion and culture. Throughout the years, storytelling has been the cornerstone of Air Jordans marketing success. Nike has crafted a captivating narrative around the brand, highlighting Michael Jordan's incredible basketball career and his impact on popular culture. Nike commercials and campaigns offer feature inspiring stories, breathtaking visuals, and epic soundtracks, all aimed at invoking a deep emotional connection with consumers. Almost every iteration of Air Jordan sneaker has a story attached to it, from the Air Jordan 1, also known as the Band 1s, to the Air Jordan 3, the first Air Jordan designed by Tinker Hatfield made famous when Michael Jordan was wearing them when he leaped from the free throw line and won the 1988 dunk contest. Or fan favorite Air Jordan 6, which Michael Jordan was wearing when he won his first championship. And of course, the Air Jordan 11, which Michael Jordan sported in the 90s cinematic classic Space Jam. All these stories help to create a personal connection between the consumer and the brand, making the Air Jordan not just a shoe, but a symbol of success, determination, and greatness. If you wanted to be like Mike, then the Air Jordan shoe was the instrument to make those dreams come true. Today, the Jordan brand brings in over $5 billion in annual revenue for Nike and is widely considered the best partnership in sports history and is a marketing slam dunk that any company can learn from. Thank you for watching another episode of this is marketing.